Thanks for joining us for today's Public Good App House demo event. I'm Bailey Maples, and I'm a Senior Program Manager with the Strategic Partnerships team here at TechSoup. So joining me today, we have Jen England, Director of Partner Success at Food Rescue Hero. Jen joined Leah Lizarondo in 2015 to launch 412 Food Rescue, building food recovery operations from the ground up. She oversaw the growth of 412 Food Rescue until she began working with Food Rescue Hero partners to ensure their successful implementation of the Food Rescue Hero app and growth of food recovery. Food Rescue Hero combines technology, last mile logistics, and community engagement to create a new food recovery and redistribution network that effectively delivers fresh and highly perishable food directly to those who need it most. The model now impacts food recovery in 12 cities, where a network of 19,000 volunteers have redirected 42 million pounds of food with a 99% service level. Thank you. Um, those numbers are old. We're at 70 million pounds redirected now, so yay. And also, I just want to say I love uh, Sign Up Genius. Um, so the relationship between food waste and hunger is pretty well known at this point. Most of you probably already know that in America, 40% of perfectly good food gets wasted while one in five people go hungry. Food recovery is a promising idea for solving these problems, but it isn't yet ubiquitous. At Food Rescue Hero, the question that we asked ourselves was if we're serious about ending food waste and hunger, then how can we scale food recovery? Do we need to just keep adding more trucks um, or bigger trucks to try to recover more food in more places? Because almost half the food that, uh, that is wasted happens at the retail level, grocery stores, restaurants, coffee shops, et cetera. These um, potential donations are everywhere and they're small, they're unpredictable, and they're time sensitive. To recover that fresh, healthy food, the traditional logistics model would be very expensive and very inefficient, making it impossible for many organizations that want to help. Through our work in food recovery, what we've learned is that volunteers using their own transportation are extremely responsive, efficient, and reliable. They provide a 99% service level on average. They just need to know where to go and what to do. If we can build a mo movement with Food Rescue Hero all over the world, then there's no limit the, to the impact that we can make together. Um, and if we can sustain that impact by keeping those volunteers engaged, rescuing food week in and week out, then we believe we can really end food waste and hunger. But technology alone won't solve food waste. Uh, community action has the power, though, to ignite change. Food Rescue Hero is designed to be a people-powered or to be people powered, we make it easy for folks to start rescuing food right in their own communities whenever they have half an hour of free time. We offer plans for organizations of any size from brand new startups to establish hunger organizations with decades of experience. Food Rescue Hero helps volunteers succeed by guiding them step by step through their food rescues. This ensures that they have all the information that they need right when they need it and it sets them up for a great experience. We also provide food rescue operations teams with training, guidance, best practices. We launched Food Rescue University this year based on the wisdom and experience of 16 partner organizations that rely on our platform. And we provide those teams with reliable data to demonstrate their impact uh, to partners, funders, the media, and other stakeholders. We accept donations via web form, and a dispatcher uses Food Rescue Heroes web app to match them with the appropriate recipient. When the, dispatch, when the dispatcher publishes that new food rescue, all nearby volunteers get a push notification letting them know about that opportunity. So here we go with that volunteer management, like how you get volunteers to know that you need them right now. Volunteers can claim a weekly rescue or um, a immediate rescue uh, one time or on a weekly basis. We also have recently launched home deliveries to increase food access and convenience for folks who maybe can't get to a neighborhood food pantry or distribution site, which includes so many people during the pandemic. For that volunteer that claimed the rescue, our mobile app then guides them through completing the rescue, provides, providing easy to follow directions and instructions every step of the way. Meanwhile, our dispatchers can monitor the status of all rescues that are happening in real time to see which ones are moving along nicely and which ones may be unclaimed or stalled so that they can reach out to the relevant people to get those rescues completed. 
Then finally, we compile all that data into reports so organizations can access all their information whenever they need it. Operations teams love Food Rescue Heroes automation, which allows them to easily onboard volunteers who can pick up a food rescue every week without needing to recruit each one or remind them individually. And volunteers love that they can request a sub whenever they're sick or out on vacation. So that day's rescue will be available for another volunteer to claim and that food won't get wasted. And our dispatchers don't have to go out and recruit that volunteer for them. Food Rescue Heroes love the app, that the app provides them with a detailed, with detailed instructions, including contact information, um, photos, which make sure that they have everything that they need to complete their food rescue, and that they can see infographics, as you can see here, showing their impact, their city's impact, their personal impact, and the entire Food Rescue Hero Network's impact. Many folks like to share these on social media, which then helps grow the movement. Um, our tech staff, if there's any techies out there, it's built with Ruby on Rails, Iconic, and um, Postgres. So if anyone's interested in seeing a full-on demo of this or learning more, they can reach out to us at info at Food Rescue Hero. You can check out our website, foodrescuehero.org. And we actually have a webinar coming up um, next week for anybody who wants to actually start doing food rescue and doesn't really know where to start. You can sign up for that on our website as well. Thank you.